morning guys and welcome back to the family fudge today I'm having a mom's morning out last night was Halloween and today school is out in the entire city so I'm headed to Target to check out the new Christmas things in the dollar spot so come along with me and as always don't forget to subscribe if you're not already and give this video a big thumbs up if you like the Target dollar spot now let's get going. Okay guys, so I'm gonna do this next part as a voiceover because I've been having issues with my audio recently, so please bear with me. Walking into the store this morning, I was so cold. It was like 50 degrees, which is cold from where I'm from. Now right off the bat, I'm already seeing things that I love. This is definitely my style. Any of these things I think would go just fine in my home. I really love this sign, have yourself a merry little Christmas. And this fresh cut Christmas tree sign is also super cute, only $3. Look at this cute tiny Christmas tree. This definitely needs to go in my cart. And check out all of these candles. They're in these really cute tins for only a dollar. I might have to pick one up for myself. But definitely these, these are catching my eye. I love the whole galvanized look of these and they have several different colors with the blue and the red and the green. And check out the Christmas pillows. We have a Joy with some mistletoe, and then this bicycle with the Christmas tree that is so cute. I know my kids would destroy these pillows, so I'm definitely going to pass, but they are really nice. Now check out all the glitter, you guys. There's gold, silver, and rose gold as well. These signs say believe, wonder, and Mary, and they were also $3. And I'm really loving this shadow box with the cute little Christmas trees, that's also $3. And they have one of these little mirror signs back there. Oop, there I am, hi guys. Back here I found another shadow box. This one says Believe with a little bell. And curious that there's only one left. And the kitchen towels, I always love the seasonal kitchen towels. This one here says Joy with the black and red checker. And then there's one with the bicycle and the tree. And then this one's probably my favorite. I meant to go back and buy this one, but I totally forgot. It says, have yourself a merry little Christmas with the red checks, which totally remind me of Noreen from Noreen's Kitchen. Now over here in the sort of kitchen wares area, you can definitely see the theme for this year. We have more of the bicycle with the Christmas tree and these cute little plates and also the pie dishes. This one says, have yourself a merry little Christmas, just like we've seen on a lot of other items. And then this one says, joy with a little mistletoe. And then we have the best time of the year with the Christmas tree. I love all of those. And check out these really cute plaid mugs. And again, with the mistletoe as well. Lots of matchy matchy cuteness this year. Now back to the sort of gold and silver and rose gold motif we have some candle holders and some sequined stockings now i wanted to check these out to see if they were mermaid sequins and they are check this out you guys i love these i'm sure my kids would love these but they're kind of small for stockings i like to have bigger stockings but they are fun to play with and those were three dollars moving over here i found so many cute table runners this one says merry christmas with bells and we also have a red one that says believe now I love table runners, but they're just not practical for my house. I know my kids would spill all over them. Oh, and look, there's a tiny little Christmas tree, an even smaller one, but this one is still $3. The bigger one was $3 as well. I don't know if that's a good deal. And these guys, these are little tins that you can put cookies or other treats in. And again, these are $3, and I know you can find something very similar at the Dollar Tree for just a dollar. Now I'm not gonna lie, I'm totally digging this charger. How cute. And then the signs. This one says joy. There's also a star back there and this Christmas tree that's very rustic looking and only $3. Digging a little further in this pile, I found some letters, like monogrammed letters. This would be really cute to add to like a wreath. Yeah, super cute. Good luck finding your initial though. It doesn't look like there's many left. And then check out this hat, it's totally in the wrong section, but how cute is this? A little reindeer. I would love it if my one-year-old would wear this, but he totally won't, he hates hats. And then look at these chunky wooden ornaments. They have quite a lot of these. Stars, trees, hearts, and these were actually just $1. Moving around the corner, I found these really cute little tin pails with cutouts in all different colors. And these were only a dollar, really nice quality. 
And then these guys, these are definitely catching my eye. We have a wood tray and they actually have a Christmas tree shape as well. Let me know in the comments down below, which one would you buy, star or Christmas tree? And these were $5 each. Now these aren't necessarily Christmas related, but they were new to the dollar spot, so I thought I'd show them to you anyway. Over here I found so many items with this California logo. Now I actually live in California, so it kind of makes sense for this to be here, but I'd love to know if your Target also carries the California stuff, or does your Target have your state that you're actually in? I'd love to know. Now over here I found the funny sign section. First off we have the Dear Santa, you kind of know how those ones go. Next to that I found this outfit scale, so you can decide whether you want your outfit to be nice or naughty. And then this guy back here totally made me laugh out loud because it describes my house for sure. This was $3 but I think I'll pass. Now over on this end cap I found a lot of little gift items. These would be perfect stocking stuffers or maybe teacher gifts, neighbors, friends, so many options. And again, we're seeing a lot of the silver, gold, and rose gold in these items. And everything is between three to five dollars. There are notebooks, water bottles, candles, and these cute little dishes. These would make excellent jewelry holders. And the phone accessories. I'm loving the sparkly charger. This was eight dollars. And there's also a rose gold one as well. And they also have some really cute infinity scarves and these have a little bit of glitter. I know my daughter would love these. Okay guys, so I'm not looking for stocking stuffers today, but Target does have a lot of options for that, as well as games and craft activities for kids as well. So many cute options. Check out these little fake snowballs, you guys, so kids can have a fake snowball fight. These were $3, and living in California where I'm at, that's all the snow we're going to get, fake snow. Now over here I found more fun, colorful Christmas decorations. Look at the little Santa and the snow globe. And there's also a snowman, very cute and sparkly. The Christmas tree, I love that one. And this really sparkly ho ho ho. And then I found these really cute signs. I know my kids would love these. We have a reindeer and a little countdown snowman. So you know how many days until Christmas. And then here's this really cute little sign. This would make some excellent pictures for Christmas time. Okay guys, before I check out of the store, I had to show you these dresses. They're actually sweaters. What do you think, yay or nay on the Christmas dresses? And look at the good deal going on right now. If you wanna buy some shoes or apparel, now's the time. So now let's head on home and I will show you everything that I picked up. So all of the items I'm gonna show you today did come from the dollar spot at Target also known as Bullseye's Playground. And I think I picked up over 30 items, so I better jump right in. The first thing I picked up was this beautiful pie pan. Now this is really heavy ceramic, pretty nicely made for just $5, and they had several different choices. But I went with the classic, have yourself a merry little Christmas. But I'm actually not gonna use this for pie at all. I'm planning on getting a plate stand to display it just like that. Next, I picked up two of these signs. Now these were $3 each, and the perfect size for decorating small spaces. This first one has a little tree with best time of the year. And then this one again says, have yourself a merry little Christmas. Definitely a big theme amongst all the stuff in the dollar spot. Then I picked up these guys. Now I love the sort of soft white color available this year. I think it's so classic, and it's easy to go with any decor you might already have. Now this one is a little rustic tree. This was $3. And this one obviously says joy, and this as well was $3. Next up I have this little shadow box. Now this was $3, and I just love the tiny little trees inside, and it can stand up on its own, so you can, it can go just about anywhere. Now this guy, when I saw this, I definitely had to get it. This was only a dollar, and it's a nice heavy wood block. But on one side it says naughty, and on the other side it says nice. And I could totally see putting this out to warn my kids during the Christmas season. So if my kids are being nice, I'll display it like this. But if they're being naughty, it's gonna get turned over to this side and then hopefully they'll be nice again. Now these next things, I just knew I had to bring them home when I saw them. It's a really awesome clay ornament kit. 
and I got one for each of my kids, but I probably should have picked up at least one extra just in case we have any boo-boos or one doesn't turn out very well. But these were actually $5, so kind of pricey, but I like that it comes with everything you need to make this ornament. It comes with the clay, the paintbrush, all the paint, all and the twine even to hang the ornament. Whoops, don't drop it. So I picked up four of those. Next up, I have this guy. Now this is actually a charger and it was $3. And they had several different ones to choose from as well. But of course I went with the Have Yourself a Merry Little Christmas. I just love that one. And I'm probably not gonna use it for a charger at all. I'd like to go ahead and display it as well somewhere around the house. Next up, I got this guy. Now this is a galvanized sort of bucket with some painted handles. And they had a version that was red and also blue silver and then I picked out the green one. I think it's super rustic looking but cute at the same time. Now I'm not quite sure what I'm gonna do with this. I'm thinking maybe a flower arrangement or something like that. But if you guys are crafty, let me know what your ideas are in the comments down below. How would you decorate with this around your house? I'd love to know. I also picked up both of these trays. This one is the star and obviously this one is the tree. And you can probably tell with the little example here, they have little ornaments inside the tray. Really cute way to display your ornaments other than your Christmas tree. Now I had a hard time deciding which one I wanted to get, but to tell you the truth, I'm probably gonna take this one back to the store, the Christmas tree one. Not because I don't like it, but when I got it home, I realized that it's a little bit damaged right along here and right on this side. So it's not huge. It wouldn't be that bad. I could probably just keep it, but I'm not quite sure. So definitely when you're in the store, make sure you take the time to look on the sides of the product to make sure you don't get a broken one. So I'll go ahead and show you the last decor item that I picked up, and then I'll show you all the fun stuff that I got for the kids. The last thing I picked up was this Christmas tree. Now these are super popular, and I know that because they only had two left, and one of them was kind of um, damaged. So I ended up only getting one, this one. This was $3 and it comes in this really nice, cute metal bucket. So cute. Now overall, I was super impressed by the styles available at Target this year. I love this sort of farmhouse rustic look and it will totally go with a look that I already have going on in my house. So that is awesome. And now let me show you what I picked up for the kids. So the first thing I picked up for the kids is this pack of pencils. Now these are Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer themed pencils and they are super cute. Now all of these things that I got for the kids are actually just $1. And this came from the sort of stocking stuffer section which was filled with awesome finds. But I'm not quite ready to buy for stockings yet. I just picked these up so the kids could use them for their schoolwork. Now, of course, I had to pick up some of the project kits from Target. My kids love these, and I really like them too. It keeps the kids occupied for quite a while. First up, I have this scratch art ornament kit. Now, this actually comes with four of these, but only one little scratcher, so the kids will have to share. But basically, you just scratch off the little outside, and it reveals the ornament underneath. Now, this one is a decorate your own tree kit. And it actually comes with six trees and a ton of stickers. So you can just decorate it however you want. This will be really great for my preschooler, so it's not too difficult. Just like the tree, I have the snowman version as well. This makes six different snowmen. You can decorate him however you want. Now every year, my kids love making ornaments, so these little kits are perfect. These are only a dollar each, and it comes with the actual ornament with the hanger already on it, and a little thing of paint and the paintbrush, so that's important. So it's all together in one kit. So we have three of the Christmas trees and three of the little Santas. Now they also had a reindeer and a snowman as well. Now here's something I know my girls will love. I'm thinking this one for Lily and this one for Mackenzie. And definitely these would make excellent stocking stuffers as well. But it's basically a little paper doll kit. So it comes with a little cutout of the character and all of these different outfit things that they can wear. So here's Shine from Shimmer and Shine. And then here is an American Girl doll one as well. Unfortunately, I didn't see one that I thought my son would enjoy. So I just picked up those two. But I know he'll like this. This is a lacing kit. So it comes with all these different holiday shapes and the laces to go with it. So it's kind of like a fine motor skill concentration activity. I know he's gonna love it. 
Okay friends, let me know in the comments down below what was your favorite item from my haul today? I would have to say my favorite is probably the ornament kit because I can just imagine having these for years to come when the kids are all grown up and they'll be so precious. And don't forget to subscribe because next time I'm headed back to the Dollar Tree because I just put out a whole lot of new Christmas decorations. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.